Welcome Style Exchange members. This is Lauren Saul and today I'm going to introduce you to your design shop. Your design shop is the place where you can share your design expertise with your community and get rewarded for your good taste. So here we are. This is my personal design shop which can, can be found at Style Exchange My Design Shop. So here we see some personal information about me and all of that can be edited at any time with these pencil icons that are closest to the information. So here, here, and then the edit photo button, they each edit the corresponding information. You can also share your entire profile by clicking on that share button to your social media channels or to individual email addresses and write a message. And now here is the bulk of my shop, the things I love. The things I love is made up of answers to questions that reveal a bit about me, product photos, and design boards. And we notice that there is an ideal mix of these different elements that make for an ideal design shop. And we happen to think it's about two product photos for every design board, and then some answers occasionally thrown in. I'm going to show you how you can control and add all of this content. So first we're going to explore Add. Add has four choices, products, board, photo, and commentary. Clicking on products will take you to browse project decor, where you can browse rooms, which are existing design boards, or products by category or by brand. Clicking on board will take you to create a new design board. Clicking on photos will allow you to upload a photo from your computer, which can be an inspiration photo or perhaps a photo from your design portfolio. I'm just going to quickly demonstrate that all for you. So, oops, we'll just go back to that. So I'm clicking on photos. Upload a file, it's pretty standard, and Barcelona chair in a room. And so now I have a photo of a Barcelona chair in a room, and I can easily tag that with a product if the product is in Project Decor's environment by clicking on it and then searching for the name of the product and then clicking on the correct product. And so now that tag is here. I can add a title to this photo or a photo credit as is necessary. I click OK and now that photo appears here. So that was adding a photo. And by the way, I can also see the product here. I can also add answers to questions to reveal a little bit more about me and my design point of view with a community. And so I've clicked on commentary. And now there are a list of questions, and I have the option to either answer them or skip them. So I'm going to skip this one and skip what is the best invention ever and answer this one. And I encourage you to really sort of think about your answers. You can keep going through this until you find questions again as they appear at random. When I answer the question, I can click Next and it will automatically save. And when I, I can close it by clicking on close. And so now we see this answer that I've just answered. So to remove it, I can remove any module by clicking on X. Okay. And I can organize these by clicking on organize. And so all of the different pieces of content appear here. And all I can do is um, drag them up and down as needed and press save and then that order will appear until we see that the votive is here. Now to browse for products that you love, you can go to browse or Project Decor's homepage and actually heart any design board or product that you love. And so this is a great way to sort of show your taste and you add a thoughtful caption and press save. And when I do this, to individual items, they will appear in my Style Exchange design shop when I return to it. And so now we see these two items here. Anyway, that's how you sort of add and also organize different material to your design shop. Please let me know if you have any questions, and we really look forward to seeing your individual design shop. Thanks.